They have a 649 for 24. What a deal. Look at this. Sam's didn't have any, but they have eggs. We need some eggs. I found the eggs. Hands for that. But they actually have eggs, and they have eggs here too. So where's the shortage? Five dozen grade A large, $15.99. Why is there a shortage? But it doesn't look like it here. It says this canned tuna was caught with a with, with a rod and reel is what it means. Pull pull and uh, pull and troll. So they troll and they catch it with a real pole. $15.99 for this. Not bad. Three thousand dollars for this set, the study room set. Can you believe it? <laughs> Don't forget your tag. Remember we had a shortage of toilet paper and paper towels. Well, I think that's over right now. Look at all the toilet paper and all the paper towels. As far as the eye can see, <laughs> it's everywhere. Holy smolies. Well, today we're shopping at Costco for bargains, so let's head in. Let's see what they got. Let's see if they have some eggs. You know what? If they have chickens, then they should have eggs, right? But how can you, how can you not have eggs but have chickens? So we're going to find out. Let's head in. Beautiful, sunny, cold day here in Florida. We're going to check the prices, and I want to find some eggs today. You know, here's the empty shelves at Costco again. <laughs> I still don't get it. Why would you not put anything on these top shelves? There's stuff on the other shelves, but there's there's nothing here and it's the same as I when I was here last time. It's still the same. I don't I just don't get it. There's a lot on the other shelves, but just nothing over here. What is the deal? <laughs> Two bowls here, just a few up here. One coffee maker here, one coffee maker there. It's just a waste of space. I don't understand it. I haven't been here for a couple of weeks and uh, maybe they could put something on the shelves here. Why isn't there anything on the shelves? <laughs> I just don't know. Honeydew melons, $4.99 for one of these guys. That's a little, that's a little pricey right there. And then the mini watermelons, $7.99 for two. Four bucks each for these guys. <laughs> what is the, what are the $7.99 for the, for the big watermelons here? I don't know what is going on. Why? $7.99? How come they're $7.99 for these? Well, I don't think the cantaloupes are too bad. $4.99 for two of these, so that's $2.50 each. That, that's acceptable. These aren't bad. These aren't bad at all. They've got a lot of them. Oh, the papaya is $4.99 each. Is it $4.99? Oh, I'd have to ask my wife if it's good. Different size. <laughs> $9.98 for 15, 15 pounds of these guys. So, and then how much are these? I like these potatoes here. Little, little potato company, these creamer potatoes. How much are these guys? Five pounds, $6.29, that's not bad. I really like these creamer potatoes. They're just delicious. Six twenty-nine for five pounds. That's a little over a dollar, dollar twenty a pound, right? And these are really good. If you've never tried these potatoes, they're just delicious. Ten pounds of onions, six twenty-nine. That's pretty good too. But you got to use ten pounds if you're only using two a week. It doesn't pay to get them. <laughs> and how much are the Vidalias here? The sweet onions. Six and a half pounds of these onions, $5.99 for these guys. But like I said, if you're not using all of them, you're just wasting money. The seedless grapes here, $5.49. These are these are over a dollar cheaper here than they were at um at the Sam's. And then here's the strawberries. $7.79. That's about the same same price. Same price. 777 at Sam's. Oh, here's the here's the blueberries. My wife saw the video and she said, "Why didn't you get me the blueberries?" <laughs> but 6.99 for these blueberries. It, it show. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Oh, I thought these are, these are blackberries. 3.29. I thought they were blueberries. But oh, here's some here. 4.99. They're not organic. They're not organic, but they're 4.99. I'm gonna get some because she loves these. She really likes these four four ninety nine, so we'll get these. But oh, asparagus seven seventy nine here. Oh, it's a thinner asparagus, two point two five pounds. So that's about right. Broccoli three pounds five 
519 if you can eat it all if you can eat it all in the corn here well see it's more here but look how tiny they are they're just tiny corns <laughs> 649 for this little bit of corn holy smolies organic bellows here 599 they were cheaper four dollars and 18 cents at sam's yep they were cheaper there and and here's the white mushrooms 389 but they're they're better deal at sam's but you know especially for the for the baby bellas here and i love these guys but 599 here well, looks like the fillets have gone up i thought they were 15.99 a pound and they've gone up to 19.99 a pound so 19.99 a pound but they still look good but 46 bucks they've they've gone up in price like everything else now the organic meat here kirkland four pounds 1988 1989 this isn't bad and it looks good too 85 15 it's organic no, no antibiotics no growth hormones 1989 and just a regular three pounds of wagyu it's really fatty 16.99 and your ground bison 1999 two and a half pounds i think it's more here than it is at sam's i could i could be wrong but this this is really good this is good stuff the bison but i i would pick this for four pounds that's your better bargain and here's your just your regular ground beef 3.99 a pound isn't too bad i tell you if you're looking for wine cost goes to place i mean holy smolies look at all the wine here this is just loaded with wine two rows of it look at all the wine <laughs> wine champagne unbelievable this is a lot right here remember we had a shortage of toilet paper and paper towels well i think that's over right now look at all the toilet paper and all the paper towels as far as the eye can see <laughs> it's everywhere holy smoly you can see the prices on the charmans they're they're pricey but this is the best you're going to find when your costs go 27 26 dollars and charman ultra 26 49 but you can see that it's like i said it's it's piled to the ceiling everywhere you look i'm, I'm surrounded by toilet paper <laughs> i like making shakes with this organic four berry blend mix three pounds and it's 9.99 it's it's on sale and this is really good for making shakes i add stevia in with this and it's just delicious and then even the even the uh organic um oh it's a smoothie blend 12.59 and this is just delicious three pounds but i like the the four bag it's on sale 9.99 but that's really good then even the blueberries when you buy the these organic blueberries here kirkland organic i'm sorry strawberries 11.69 for four pounds this is really good for making delicious shakes and, and i love this stuff and that's a good price six pounds not organic is 13.99 but these are good too but organic i think it's a better value at 11.69 really good oh the three berry blend 14.99 though oh i really like this and it's got the it's got the blackberries raspberries blueberries and, and blackberries in it but it's 14.99 but this is really good really delicious oh i like that oh here's what i looked at before the himalayan salt potato chips kettle brand 579 32 ounces these are really good chips in the ruffles my favorite it seems like everything's my favorite what what is it 27 ounces 749 things are going up they're really everything's going up in price here everything is going up 799 for whatever this is 729 doritos last time they were on sale for for 449 but not anymore 649 but still try to go to a regular supermarket you'll pay a lot more look what's on sale these terra 739 for 439 you get 15 no 20 ounces this is these are really good sweet potato taro i don't even know what that is and parsnip but 439 i'm getting the bag <laughs> delicious uh oh swiss miss oh geez <laughs> 
but that's a good bargain right there. Remember I was pricing um, plastic ware at, uh, at Walmart? You get 500 spoons for 12, 12.99, there's 500, I mean forks, 500 forks for 12.99, and you get probably 500 spoons for 12.99, and then you get this entire cutlery set for 15, dollars compared to what they had at it's at walmart for 15.79 it's expensive but this is this is your best bet right here spoons uh knives and forks that's that's a better deal if you're going to have a party their carry gold has gone up in price it's it used to be 9.99 and now the carry gold is is 12 12.59 for carry gold butter 12.59 for two two pounds of butter Oh jeez! In in the regular butter right here, and this is the salted that I want. Fourteen forty nine for the salted butter. So twelve fifty nine, fourteen forty nine. Why is this going up? It's ridiculous. Two pounds for twelve fifty nine. That's insane. Twelve fifty nine for this and fourteen forty nine for this. It just doesn't make any sense. But I'm gonna get this. Not that, tool 59. No way, no way. And their ketchup has gone up. 11.79 for three. Oops, she's 11.79 for three. This used to be eight something. Used to be eight something for ketchup for three of these guys. And there we go. And now look at the 11.79, it's just going up. Just going up, but this, oh, look at the, the avocado mayonnaise, 7.69. They had to take two bucks off. They can't sell it. <laughs> two of these squeeze mayonnaise, $9.99. Jeez, what's the deal with mayonnaise? Why? Why is it so expensive? Why? Oh, because it's made with egg and there's no more eggs. <laughs> I haven't found the eggs yet. Now their yellowfin tuna is pretty good. Six five ounce cans, $12.99. And this is really good. I'm a, I'm a canned tuna fan. That's good right there. That's the best? I wouldn't doubt it. How is the other albacore right there? The no, wild? I don't like it. You don't like it? No, it's a good brand and everything, but... Uh, that yeah. looks really good. Yeah. I yeah. Just the packaging, even $12.99. That's not bad. Chicken of the Sea, if you're interested in that, $17.39 for that. And it's the same price as this bumblebee. I'm not a fan of bumblebee. I don't know why, but... And the one customer said that this isn't good, but... What, Pole and troll caught <laughs> right here. Albacore, wild tuna, sustainably pole and line caught. Now that's interesting. So they've caught these by by line and pole. I've never seen that before, but $15.99. Caught by hand. It says this canned tuna was caught with a with, with a rod and reel is what it means. Pole, pole and uh, pole and troll. So they troll and they catch it with a real pole. $15.99 for this, not bad. Oh, here's some pink salmon, $15.99. But I, I tell you what, I think I'd go with that other, the, the yellowfin, boneless and skinless. But this is high in omega right here, which is supposedly good for you. I guess, uh, you know, I eat the, the uh, pasteurized cheese, but you, yet I'm looking at stuff like this, but wild caught Alaska pink salmon. That's what I look for, $15.99. See, this is good to have on hand, really good stuff. Now, Here's what I like, the Sierra Lee, $3.59 for these restaurant style buns right here. $3.59 for these, 12 count. Then you have the 16 count right here, $3.59. This is, this is what I buy right here. And then you have, if you want the potato rolls, which I bought this before, where are they? They had the potato buns, potato rolls. Here's the potato rolls, and these are right here, and I don't like them as much, $6.89. So $6.89 for this, or $3.59 for, for these. Almost half, almost half the price for, for this, and these are better than these. And, and I don't know why, but these are just a lot better. And my favorite Hawaiian rolls, still $6.59. They haven't come down in price. I remember I used to buy these for $4.48, and now they're $6.59. And they just keep going up and up and up. Just like everything else, just keeps going up. Here's some Dole pineapple chunks, six 20 ounce containers, $10.99 a can, but not bad, really good. And here's a sale right here, fruit bowls, 16 four ounces, 
$7.49. These are great in lunches. This is a good deal right here. I always look for bargains like this. Anybody that has kids, and look at these, the mandarins. Oh, I love the mandarins. $7.39 for these guys. 16 of these cups so you can just sit down and continually eat them. That's a good deal right there. That's a bargain right there. Look how many they have. Holy smolies. <laughs> they have eggs. They have eggs. $6.49 for 24. What a deal. Look at this. Sam's didn't have any, but they have eggs. That's not too bad, right? What, $3.25 for a dozen? <laughs> if you consider that not bad, at least they have some. Look at all the eggs. Holy smolies. $7.59. That's not too bad, huh? No, not too bad. Organic. <laughs> we need some eggs. I found the eggs. Look at that. Not bad. Oh, got to be careful. I need two hands for that. But they actually have eggs, and they have eggs here too. So where's the shortage? Five dozen, grade A large, $15.99. Why is there a shortage? But it doesn't look like it here. Why is there a shortage of eggs at Sam's and everywhere else? But I'm, but I'm looking at a ton of old eggs behind me right here. What's the deal? <laughs> I don't believe that. If there's chickens, there's got to be eggs. These eggs right here, $6.49 for 24 of these guys. And you can see they're everywhere. <laughs> Sam's didn't have one single solitary egg. But this orange juice here, it's tangerine though, $8.99. I wonder how this tastes. I bet it's good though, $8.99. In the orange juice, two 59 ounce containers, organic. I bet it's good, but five bucks each. But I'd rather have this. I'd rather have this than some of that other stuff. Because you can see, you see how it's down in the bottom. That looks good, the pulp. And tangerine, I bet this is really good. Look at the pulp. Look at the pulp in the bottom. I bet that's delicious, right? $8.99, $4.50 each. I'd, I'd give it a try. Well, you know, I hate to say it, but $13.99 for something like this, <laughs> it's a little pricey just for a, an outside dining set. It seems really cheap at $1,400 plus tax. And it comes in a box. You got to put it together. <laughs> There's the price, $29.99 for that. Are you kidding me? Holy smolies. <laughs> $3,000 for this set, the dining room set. Can you believe it? <laughs> Don't forget your tax. $22.99 for that. It's, it's hard to believe. It's plastic. I, I don't know why this stuff is expensive. I mean, all this stuff is so cheap, and it comes in a box, and it's thousands of dollars. I don't get it. Does Costco really need to sell furniture? I mean, $12.50, and it, this is just... I, I don't even think it's wood. I think that's just paper on top of it, but $1,250 bucks for, $1 for that, and it comes in a box. <laughs> $13.99 for that, comes in a box. I mean, it just seems a little pricey for something that comes in a, in a box this big, and that's it right there. I don't get it. Well, $15, $15.79 for that one right there, and it comes in a box. So that means it's all in pieces. And this is it. This is your box. <laughs> and here's another one for each 79. There's the box. <laughs> I don't get it. Is that possible? This must be the round table. And that must be what, the chairs? But eight, 879, there's your boxes. Put it. I saw something really neat. It's a greenhouse, six by seven or by eight, 1389. This is really neat right here. If anybody's looking for a greenhouse, this would be neat. No matter where you're at, even in Florida during the cold months. But this is this kind of neat, right? Look at that. This is I like this. Yeah, I'm sure you have to assemble it, but fourteen hundred dollars. But uh, you can just set it right on the grass. Thirteen eighty nine. I kind of like it. That's really neat, huh? I I think I think I like it. <laughs> Better not show my wife. This is all we really need for plants, right? <laughs> Well, there was our uh, shopping haul at uh, Costco, and my wife bought a lot of stuff, and I kept saying, how much is this? And she said, I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the show. I saw a lot of stuff in there, furniture, which I thought was way overpriced, and I found eggs. <laughs> Can you believe it? Anyways, give me a thumbs up or like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with The Real Economy. We'll see you.